focused on the reawakening of societal consciousness on the importance of having eco-friendly sanitary facilities in every household and ensuring proper management of sewage. You may recall that 19th November of every year is marked as World Toilet Day as declared by the United Nations General Assembly in 2013. This year's commemoration focuses on toilet and nature, raising awareness and inspiring action to tackle global sanitation crisis, promoting access to toilets for everyone and everywhere, ending open defecation, and ensuring that toilet construction, operation and use, and management are eco-friendly, ecosystem friendly. Ladies and gentlemen, access to sanitary facility remains a mirage to the vast majority of our citizens. Today, worldwide, about 4.5 million people in the world live without safe toilets, and roughly about 900 million people still practice open defecation. As many people still use both the bush and water body, bodies as their regular means of excreta disposal. Many institutions do not have sanitary facilities, and where they exist, they are neither not functional or well or are misused. One of the major consequences of poor excreta disposal is the high rate of diarrhea diseases which is the second cause of high rate of morbidity and mortality among children under the age of five. The persistent reoccurrence of annual incidences of cholera, cholera outbreak in some of our states and the occurrence and reoccurrence of other excreta related diseases are also manifestation of inadequate toilet facilities. Yet, this could also be prevented through safe excreta disposal by every individual. The federal government of Nigeria is committed to addressing these sanitation challenges, including ending open defecation in the country and ensuring proper management of excreta. This commitment is demonstrated by Mr. President's recent declaration of state of emergency on water, sanitation, and hygiene in the country. Also, the Federal Ministry of Environment, in collaboration with critical stakeholders, is reviewing the national environmental sanitation policy, including its policy guideline on safe excreta and sewage disposal. The community-based waste management program, as well as the clean and green program of the ministry, I aim, among others, at promoting the provision of safe and adequate toilets across the country, particularly in public places, and ensuring proper excreta management. The 12th National Council on Environment, recently held in Akure, Ondo State from 29th to 31st October 2018, approved and directed the Federal Minister of Environment to develop a national policy for the declaration of national emergency on open defecation. I therefore challenge all stakeholders on environment, particularly sanitation, at the national, state, and local government levels, not only to do the talking, but take practical steps and action, individually and collectively, as agents of change, to ensure every one has access to eco-friendly sanitation facilities. The Federal Ministry of Environment, in collaboration with other stakeholders, has put together a series of activities to mark the 2018 World Toilet Day commemoration as follows. There is going to be school people sensitization, competition and education through games and artworks. Sanitary inspection of federal government premises who we'll go and inspect some federal government establishments, their you know, toilets and so on. 
sanitary inspection of markets and motor parks will be going to some markets, motor parks and other public outfits to inspect their toilets. Community awareness campaign, we are going to create awareness among the community. World Toilet Day commemoration at Barcelona Hotel will be converging on Barcelona Hotel, we say too, on the 19th of November 2018 to celebrate the day. I equally want to use this opportunity to solicit the support of the press, development partners, NGOs, CSOs, the organized private sector, and indeed everyone for the sanitation program of my ministry. Gentlemen of the press, it is our expectation that you will help to sensitize and enlighten the populace on issues of sanitation and hygiene, which are of global concern. Finally, when nature calls, please think health and safety environment and respond in an environmentally friendly manner. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your attention and God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria.